promoting a sustainable Hawaii with a feast tonight. Yep, Violin News reporter Melody Gonzalez shows us how a community gathered to talk about ways to protect our future. It's a feast over locally sourced foods that's bringing together key members of the community. Oh, wow, the they may play different roles, but all have the common goal a sustainable Hawaii. Sustainability can take many forms. Whether that's the food that you eat or the products that you consume. So it's personal to me and, and when you love something you want to protect it. Protecting the future of the state is at the top of the menu for many in attendance including Big Island server and filmmaker Allison Teal. I mean, literally almost half of our reefs since 2011 are gone in Hawaii. They're dead. And that can be really scary and you know, you, you don't want to ruin tourism in Hawaii. We, we want people to come visit this beautiful place. Talking story across the dinner table at Mahina and Sons, the sustainable seafood eatery at the Surf Jack in Waikiki. Aqua Aston Hospitality, which owns the hotel plus three dozen more with the majority across Hawaii, partnered with all natural sunscreen raw elements to focus on maintaining a sustainable future for tourists and locals. So we provide our guests with reef safe sunscreen dispensers free of use. So hopefully this is a way that, you know, someone seeing that dispenser and saying, wait, wait a minute, there's sunscreen here and then they, they read the board and it's like, like, oh, reef safe. Maybe they didn't even know about that issue. But the Reef Safe initiative goes beyond sunscreen when guests stay at an Aqua Aston Hospitality's hotel. Our um, hotel is green certified, eliminating plastics, introducing um, eco kits to our guests. It's initiatives like the sunscreen, beach cleanups, and locally sourced food that brings organizations together, including sustainable coastlines and local IA, to work toward a sustainable Hawaii. One company cannot do it alone. We're all in this together, and the more um, stakeholders we can get to raise the volume on this important discussion, the more successful we'll be. They always say act local, think global, and I think that's what we're doing here tonight. Melody Gonzalez, Island News.